Now, all this month across Ireland AM, we are supporting local enterprise and explaining why buying local should always be a priority for us. Joining me today are Mark Kelly, the Kick Company, that's the company he's from, and Cahill Sheridan from Huku Balance. Good morning. Mark, we'll come over to you in a minute. <laughs> now, Mark. Hey, Simon. How are you, sir? OK. You brought a little small bit of equipment here. Tell us, first Tiny. of all, about your business. What is it? Well, this is the Skill Masters by the Kick Company, and the it's kind company. of turning, yeah. Okay. They, they kick company okay and it's about getting active that's okay. what the company is about we we are coaches we've seen kids come into training and telling us that they're not training at home okay. we thought let's do something about it and it was so we're just getting their two hours once a week or two hours twice a week at the football training yeah scheduled activity yeah. and then after that nothing <clears throat> so okay. the, the, the big the big concern globally is about getting kids active and long term and keeping them in participation okay and we're trying to be part of that but then also develop players along the way, give them the skills to get engaged. Yeah. And when we did that, it was a, a whole process from 2018. And that so it's a new company again, like Cahill's, new business. Absolutely, from the ground up. Okay. And it's, it's working with sport, but focused on, on the kids, focused then on players as they develop up through the transitions Very from good. grassroots to competitive sport. And tell me, in terms of developing the business then, there are supports out there for businesses like yours you availed of those? Absolutely. Um, we worked with Monaghan Enterprise and are still doing that today. Really? Breach and the team in, in, in Monaghan Leo were fantastic. Uh, from day one, they just said, how do we go about this? What can we do? And we're still there and it's a good good partnership. Well, young Jerry is going to give us a demo of what the wall should do. So, Mark, while Jerry's doing that, yep. tell me, is it aimed at all, all skill levels? All, all skill levels, all multi-sport. Multi it's about the fact that practice multiple sports, give anything a go, um, you know, don't be hyper selective. And you kids and households have many different interests could be rugby, could be soccer, could be Gaelic. Yeah. So, this was about encapsulating that versatility. And it's home. not just aimed at the big ball sport either, it's the, the slitters right. there as well. S uh, slitter, tennis ball, rugby ball, soccer, Gaelic. And that's the thing, it's, it's about accommodating them, but giving them full performance values that you would have, say, on the playing field. And they provide you then with different types of exercises. As Jerry was explaining to me earlier on, you saw him going from the top level here to the bottom. This would be for groundwork then, as you yeah. said. Yeah, so you, this is the harder workout. This, this is the fast. Speaking as an ex-goalkeeper, <laughs> this is the harder workout, yeah, isn't it? That's correct. Um, they, like you, as you mentioned, goalkeeping, um, yeah. even upper body, throwing the ball over your head for soccer, yeah. upper body control, lower body control, and then even mimicking passes. It's no point just kicking empty. Start, focus right. on a target. And do you design programs around how to use it and get the most out of it? We're going into that. Very Initially, good, yeah. it was about getting the product, but that's our next step. And that's the next phase is coming uh, with the company. And that's what we're currently working on with our local enterprise board. And, and you're Greek. still getting the help. I'll Absolutely. have to have a go, Jerry, won't I? Right, yeah. i got that for a hand pass. Now, the first time I did this, this ended up in the loading bay 60 yards <laughs> behind it. So I'm going top level there. Oh, good man, yeah. So all I'm doing is that. And am I looking for a certain spot or anywhere? That's up to you. The red horizontal line is mimicking crossbar. And then oh, the, right, so the I'm going to get over there for a point. Good oh, man. Oh, yeah, boy, yeah. I tell you, it's not easy, is it? It's a, there's but, a good reaction off it. Oh, your skills are coming back. Muscle memory's there. Yes, and yeah. Uh, and then the red vertical back to line. Yeah. The so red what's the red vertical line? It's about selecting angles, shot selection. So you're, you're going from one side to the other. Right, we'll try and get one over the bar there on the left. No, that's there too, too go. low. There we there are. go, yeah. That's so the winning that's point. <laughs> that's exactly Brilliant. what it's about. Putting, putting emphasis and putting And purpose. it's a bit of crack. And Absolutely. it's fun. Fun Listen, activity. continued success. Thank you very much. Great Simon. product. Mark, thank Carl, you. thank you so much. Right, let's see how Elaine's getting on. Back in the studio, Elaine. I'm getting on better than you out there anyway, that's for sure, Simon. Anyway, up next, there's an old nip in the air lately. We'll have some more autumnal styles on the catwalk. See you for that soon.